This drug is Pippali, Piper Longum from the family Piperaceae. It's also a climber like Maricha, but it is not rooting adenoid. So you can find this as a scandent uh, shrub or a climber which is not rooting at nodes like a maricha. Okay. In this maricha also, uh, sorry, pipali also, you can find leaves simple. See, you have a growing end. The leaves are simple. Okay. Leaves are simple. And then, see this lamina. Lamina is cardate ovate. Cardate ovate. See, this is cardate shape and ovate broadest at the base and gradually tapered towards the apex so this is cardate ovate and it is deeply cardate you can see this um, um, branching like this so this is deeply cardate we use the word deeply cardate lamina is deeply cardate don't confuse with the maricha and pipali the leaves see here the pipali leaves are very much thin the pipali leaves are very much thin both are both leaves are cardate ovate but that was very thick and this is very much thin. The leaves are very much thin. And then prominent nerves, six to eight nerves. It is multi-costate reticulate venation. We'll call it as multi-costate reticulate venation. So a climber, leaves simple, cardate, ovate, deeply cardate at the base. And then six to eight now from the base, leaves are very much thin. And then flowers um, are uh, small, minute, and uh, spikes. I don't have the flowers here. I'll show you the fruits. So this is the enga fruit. See the fruit in the spike, whereas the small berries are the bucket fruits, we'll say, will be sunken within this solid spike. So in this points, actually these small berries will be sunken within this solid fleshy spike. Or you can understand more here. See here. See these are the small small fruits. Small small bucket or beshi, fresh uh, berry fruits, fleshy fruits that are sunken in this um, fleshy spike. And this will be the fruit. Complete fruit will the will be by the. Um, number of this multiple fruits and this fruit will be a complete fruit this is long fruit like this only somewhere around four centimeter five centimeter four centimeter around so this is um, complete fruit matured fruit but it is not ripened if it is ripened it will turn to reddish okay so this pipali like we will call it as Palati Pru Dhatu atas Palati Purana Yohu that was which was uh, nourishing and maintaining ning the body and it is also called as Upakulya. It grows near the water sources. This pipali grows near the water sources that is why it is called as Upakulya and it is called as Krishna, Kana, um, Ushana, all that things I told you in the context of Marija as that it is having um, pungent taste that is kathurasa as that it is kathurasa it is called as um, krishna kana ushana because of the ushnavirya all that things this is the dried fruits of pippali that is piper piper langam we have two varieties of piper langam that is bada pippali and chota pippali bada pippali is something like um, a long striped uh, blunt spikes a long striped um, blunt spikes of somewhat uh, reddish brown color reddish brown color and uh, it will continue contains uh, a multitudes of many this is a spike complete spike inflorescence was spike and uh, after fruiting uh, this you can see because uh, the ovary matures into fruit. See this contains or comprises of a multitudes of minute bucket fruits. 
and this is a complete fruit of pipali so that is piper langam and uh, this is called as bada pipali so somewhere around uh, 2 to 4 cm long and about 8 mm diameter this is called as bada pipali in the market and this is called as chota pipali so immature uh, spikes are converted into fruits this is about some 2 cm length and again around uh, some 5 mm uh, diameters that we can see and this is called as chota pipali and you can see some slightly it is curved usually the chota pipali will be longer slender um uh, slender and little curved that what we get in the market so this pipali um the main useful part is fruit but the root is also used pipali both moola and phala is used and uh, phala mainly used in kasa shwasa it is used as a deepaniya it is used agni deepaka ama pachaka shamaka and its pipali is also very good brushya and rasayana it is a brushya it is rasayana and it is used in shwasa and kasa